Hey guys and welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be my fall must-haves slash my fall favorites. So I'm going to be sharing with you what I have been loving this fall. Although fall has already started, I have had all these things out for a while. I put half the stuff out in September and also a lot of these things are just things I've had for years and I really love and enjoy. So I thought I would share with you guys what I have been enjoying for fall. And I actually did a fall favorites last year, so I will actually link it down below if any of you guys are interested to see that video from last year, and it was a collab. So I'll link that one down below just in case you guys would like to see that one as well. And hopefully I don't have any doubles. I know one thing in here I did mention last year, but I had to mention again this year. But other than that, I'm hoping I don't have doubles. So maybe I should have watched that video before I made this one. But anyways, I'm going to jump right into my video because I know I can talk a lot. So I'm going to try to get through this without rambling on. So the first few things I want to share with you guys is going to be home decor. And the first thing is going to be this pillow from Target. It is from their Target dollar spot. It is new this year and I just fell absolutely in love with it the colors are gray and white and it just goes so well with my house although I do decorate with traditional colors I do want to eventually switch over to more natural colors I think next year I want to go for like gray white and like a mint green but we'll see what happens but anyways I really loved this pillow bought it from Target and it was only five bucks and I bought two of them the next two things are going to be pumpkins and they're also from the Target's dollar spot from this year. I'm not sure if they had these out last year, but I did pick these up this year and I believe they were three or five dollars. I think this one might have been five and then this smaller one might have been three dollars, but they are so pretty. This one's more of like a yarn material and it's the traditional orange with a little brown stem up there. And then this one is more of a different um, fabric. I don't even know how to explain it, but I just love the color. It's more of like a natural nude color. And then it has like kind of like a beige color inside. And then it also has like the little wooden stump on top. And I just loved these. I have these set out in my living room and they look so cute out. And of course, next, I did have to mention a Mrs. Myers product. I love Mrs. Myers. I always get each scent for each season. And I love the apple cider one. They also have a pumpkin one. And I don't know if it was just me, but when I smelled the pumpkin in the bottle, I thought it smelled so good and I got so excited, I brought it home. And as soon as I started spraying it in my kitchen and was cleaning my countertops, it just stunk so bad. It did not smell good at all. It did not smell anything like the bottle. So I ended up bringing that back and returning it and just getting another apple cider one. But the apple cider one smells really good. I also have the dish soap and also the hand soap, but I just brought up the um, multi-purpose cleaner to show you. But that is definitely one I have been using a lot. Next is going to be some wax melts. This one is from my local grocery store, Kroger. It is by Tuscany Candle and the scent Falling Leaves. And if you guys like cinnamon smells, you will definitely like this one. It has a very strong cinnamon smell to it, and it just smells like fall. It smells amazing, very cinnamon. So if you guys like cinnamon and you have a Kroger, I would definitely try to look for the falling leaves. They have a bunch of other scents that smell really good. I have a few other ones. I'm not sure what they're called, but I do have a few other ones. Okay, so the next wax melt case I have is from Walmart. The brand is Sensationals and it's in No Place Like Home Sweet Cinnamon Warm Clove. It smells so good. It's, you can definitely smell the clove in here. I love the scent of cinnamon. As you guys can tell, I have this one that smells exactly like cinnamon. And then this one also smells like cinnamon, but it just it smells really good. I think these were like $1.99, maybe $2.99 at Walmart. So a really good price. And then this one, if you have the Kroger card, I believe is like $1.99 as well. And they both come with six little wax melt cubes. Next two things is going to be candles. This one's also from that brand at Tuscany Candle. And this one's in Harvest Cider. It smells amazing, you guys. It smells so good. It smells a lot like cider, which I also like the scent of cider, but you can also smell the apple in it. It just smells really good. And one thing that I really like about this candle is that it melts all the way around. As you guys can see, I'm already down here from burning it and it melts all the way around. I hate when I get a candle and it only melts like in the middle and there's like a bunch of wasted wax all around. So I really love how it actually melts all the way around. But this scent is in Harvest Cider. Like I said, I bought it from my local grocery store, Kroger. It smells amazing. And then the second candle I'm going to show you guys is from Bath and Body Works and it is their new white pumpkin. Of course, my yearly staple, I always get leaves. I have like three leaves downstairs. 
those i really love but this year i've really been loving white pumpkin and the notes on this one is white pumpkin autumn spice blend and ground cinnamon it just smells so good if you guys are not too crazy about pumpkin scents because they're too overpowering for you this one might be a good one you can definitely smell the pumpkin but it's not as overpowering it's more of like a subtle pumpkin smell with mixed with like a clean scent i don't even know how to explain it but it smells really good i've really been loving this and i'm so sad every time i go back to my local bath and body works they are always sold out of this scent so i only have one wallflower and then one candle but if i can get my hands on any more i'm definitely gonna grab some the next thing is going to be a mug from target and this was three dollars and it's a pretty large size which i really like because i drink a lot of coffee and tea so i can put a lot of coffee and a lot of tea in here and then in gold it just says let's stay home i thought it was really cute so i bought this from target dollar spot for three dollars and i have been drinking out of this a lot next is going to be a caramel apple i love caramel apples now i've never been a fan of candy apples i don't know why but i've just never liked them but caramel apples i can destroy i love them i like them plain or i like them with peanuts this one is from my grocery store and they're always sold out of the caramel ones they always have candy ones but last time i went they had some and i picked them up and they are delicious i feel like it's not fall if you do not have a caramel apple and of course i did have to mention a pair of boots so these boots i've had for probably like four maybe even five years but they go all the way up to my knee or a little bit below my knee and they're just black they have a tiny little heel not even a heel like kind of like a stump right there i don't know what you would call that but yeah it's not too high and then it has a buckle around here and then it zippers all the way up and like i said it goes probably a little under my knee and they're just so comfortable i've had these for years and i probably should get a new pair because up here they're like getting a little destroyed just because i've had them for so long i don't even know where i bought these from it doesn't say the brand on it let's see if i can find the brand I have no clue where I bought these. It just says like the size and stuff. It doesn't say the brand, but I'm pretty sure I bought it from like Marshalls or Target because I get a lot of my shoes from there as well. But these are just super comfortable and they go with a lot of my outfits. Next is going to be this sweater shirt. I bought this from H&M, I think one or two years ago. Yeah, it's from H&M. I don't know. I think I might've bought it like two years ago and it's just kind of like that burnt orange color and it's just so comfortable. I always buy these type shirt sweaters, like a size or two bigger because I like them to be oversized and I like to wear them like with leggings and it's just super comfortable and long. So anytime I wear leggings, it covers my butt. So yeah, I love this sweater. And then I really love this one as well. This one's like a burgundy color, like maroon color. And it's super long. It goes probably all the way down to my knees. And then it has some pockets up here. I'm horrible at showing this, but that's how it looks. And this is from, okay, the tag is ripped off. So I don't even know where this is from, but I think it might be from Walmart. I'm not hundred percent sure, probably Walmart, but that is how long it is. And it's super, super comfy. And I pair this up with so many different outfits and boots. So love this then i feel like it just would not be a fall favorites or fall must-haves video without some fall movies of course i had to mention hocus pocus and i know i mentioned this last year my fall favorites but i had to mention it again because this has been my favorite movie for so long since i've been a kid when i was younger my mom would always ask me and my best friend what we wanted to watch after school and we would always say hocus pocus no matter what time of year it was and I'm still obsessed with this movie. I love it. I watch it every year and it's just a staple. You have to watch this when it's fall. Another movie that I had to mention that I love to watch around fall time is Halloween Town. It is another Disney movie and I love that movie. Every year I make sure to watch Halloween Town and also Hocus Pocus. And what's very surprising to me is that a lot of people don't even know Halloween Town. Last year I posted a picture of me watching the movie on my Instagram and had so many comments of people asking what that movie was and they, they've never heard of it before, which is crazy because I feel like it was a popular movie when it first came out. I'm not sure how old it was when it came out. I think I was probably in middle school when that movie came out, but that movie is a really good movie. I love it. It's super cute and I still always watch it around this time of year. I'll actually insert a picture for you guys to see. 
you guys aren't familiar with that movie, but that movie is also another staple of mine that I have to watch every year. Okay guys, so this is going to end my fall favorite slash fall must haves. I really hope that you enjoyed today's video. If you did, please remember to give it a big thumbs up. And if you have not already, hit that subscribe button, subscribe to my channel. I would love to have you join my YouTube family. And remember to turn on your notification bell so anytime I do upload, you'll be notified that I have uploaded a new video. Thank you so much for watching and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.